when Stai Hung Wei, who is blind, took part in the torch relay for the opening of the 2023 Asian Para Games in China, she was guided by a four-legged robot dog. The robot worked well on this flat surface, but has limitations. Most robotic dogs on the market have four legs at stepping pairs, leaving them balancing on two legs at any time. This makes them unstable. Now scientists at Shanghai's Jiao Tong University have developed a six-legged robot dog, which is more stable than the four-legged version. Field tests are now underway for these six-legged robots, which can communicate as well as walk. It uses artificial intelligence technology for voice recognition. Its camera can detect when an obstacle is in the way. And with six legs, the robot is stable, going up and down stairs. For now, I can tell it where I'm going through voice conversations. I can control the speed with this blind cane. If I need it to go faster, I just push it all the way forward. If I need it to slow down, I just pull it back and it will adjust its speed. Unlike real guide dogs, this artificial dog also has route planning capabilities. The machine can navigate using its cameras and sensors, including recognizing traffic lights. There are only more than 400 guide dogs in service in China. We have nearly 20 million blind people. It is impossible to solve this problem with guide dogs. Robots are a lot like cars, and we can mass produce them in the same way as cars. It will become more affordable. There's still a long way to go before such robots become readily available. And while they might not be as cute as real guide dogs, the hope is that in the near future, these robot companions could become a good substitute for the animal called man's best friend. Michael Voss, CGTN.